Hello, so it's Tom Nicholson here from the Oxford Artisan Distillery with the lovely Paul Pridden. How are you, sir? I'm very well indeed, Tom. Paul Pridden is the guy that helped build and design this beautiful beastie. Uh, he's also the man behind the uh, Flying Scotsman and I believe many other steam engine boiler housings. Indeed, lots of boilers have been uh, restored in our time. Tell us a little bit about you. How did you get into this game? After I left school at 18, I started work with my father at his company, RK Pridham Engineering which manufactured and repaired steam locomotive boilers. Our business continued to grow and then approximately 10 years ago uh, was bought by the South Devon Railway Company and integrated into their works. It was through South Devon Railway Engineering that I was contacted by Tom and Corey um, who initially asked whether we could repurpose an old steam locomotive to turn it into a still. Uh, this somewhat eccentric idea wasn't really practical but something caught my interest so I met further with them and we talked about the possibility of fabricating a still from scratch to a new design. At our initial meeting uh, Tom and Corey obviously had um, some ideas of the visual uh, image they wanted to portray with their still and they gave me a brief to include elements of um, Victoriana, uh, Maritime, um, Jules Verne's 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea uh, to see if we could incorporate those aspects into the design. So after um, initial concepts were submitted, we toyed around with the ideas and finally came up with what you see behind me. It certainly is a piece of art combined with a very practical working machine indeed.